Hello everyone, and welcome back to the next episode in my Dark Souls playthrough. So I went down the hallway, a couple hallways, and ended up in this gigantic archive. Books up the walls, ladders, and movable stairs everywhere. Also full of a bunch of like crystal type skeletons, which were kind of cool, though also <laughs> kind of annoying, managed to stumble my way upon the scaleless dragon. I did not expect to find him in there at all. I was, I figured that was the one place I would not see him. But I very quickly learned that I am not meant to fight him yet. There is some kind of ring apparently I need to get in order to even stand in the room with him. We spent some time navigating my way through there, found some neat little things, but one of the last things I got was a pendant. And I'm curious if that pendant might be what I need to do the next step in the DLC see that I've been trying to figure out how to do. So that's what we're going to go in this episode. If by some chance this is your first time finding my channel, welcome. Hope you have a fantastic time. And if you do have a really good time, it sure does help me out when you consider hitting that subscribe button. All right, I have found out that there are two DLCs in this thing, and I'm going to maybe take a crack at one or the other, depending on if I can get either one of them to work. All right, welcome back, everybody. Hope you're doing fantastic. So... I just realized I've got four humanity at the moment. So as I said in the intro, uh, okay, so two things. One, we're going to see if we can get the DLC to work based upon that pendant thing I just found. But I found out something interesting in a recent comment. There are two DLCs. And this doll that I found that I wasn't quite sure what to do with, apparently this is how you access one of the DLCs. Uh, and I'm hoping that this is how I access the other. Now, this one uh, is the one I'm going to go try over there where the waterfall and stuff is all at. See if anything happens down there. This one, the hint I was given was think about places where you've seen paintings. And a Norlando is like the only place I can think of off the top of my head where I've seen paintings. So... I want to go here first because I feel like this is the one I've really been working towards. If that doesn't work and it doesn't trigger anything, we might go and explore the castle and see if we can find some place where maybe this doll reacts. That's the plan for this video. Uh, hopefully we have some success with at least one of those objects. Oh, and you know what? I can just teleport out of here, can't I? No need to run. Oh, as usual, I am excited to get to play tonight. I hope you guys are all doing well. Mm, let's see, what's it? Oh, you know what? What, what? I'm trying to remember which one I was using to get back to. I was using the, um, the sunlight altar. That's the one I was using. But, real quick, <laughs> look at me. Already distracted. What am I? Two minutes into the episode? My goodness, it happens so quick and easy. But someone told me if I go back down to where my fire keeper was, I might find a little surprise. I'm assuming that's maybe because I avenged her. Examine. Dead. Aw. Let's see if there's anything else in the area. Oh. I'm not seeing anything, actually. Oh, it's a bummer. Giving it a little, little bit of a look. See here. Someone told me I could like cannot light bonfire. They said there is a way that I can relight this. And the hint that they gave me was try looking back down where she was at. But. I'm not seeing anything where she was. Huh. Maybe I have not finished whatever step is required. Can I... Can I break in here? Hmm. Okay, well, that mystery, I guess, is going to continue. Oh, and you know what? We have this... This one soul that I picked up, and I have not dropped it off at the shrine yet, so let's go ahead and drop that in there. Oh, not you. 
Now, someone also told me I don't even have to ride this guy anymore to get down there. I can just run and jump into the hole. So let's give that a try. <laughs> I was a little nervous as being trolled. But I was like, I gotta at least try it. Oh, yeah. Finally. A decent mode of transportation. Now, does he show up down here? Nope. I guess I'm warping out of here. Okay, let's go ahead and offer the soul. So that's three. I think the only one I still need now is the Scaleless Dragon. If I'm if I'm uh, remembering everything correctly, I thought there were four souls I had to get. And since those knights turned out to be one of the the souls, I think the scaleless dragon is the only one left. Is my speaking of dragons, is he up here? Part of me feels like I should give this guy a try. Let's see if he comes flying over. Hello? Dragon? Oh! He's like, hey, where'd my buddies go? Poor guy. Oh, I was gonna see if I could attack that dragon. I was feeling frisky. Oh, there it is. Woo! Oh, you still managed to burn me. Whoop. Woo, we light it up. All right, come on down. Let's 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 dance, buddy. Come on. I'm I'm feeling lucky. Coming. Have I ticked you off enough yet? Yeah, let's try this. Can I lock on for me? Oh boy. He ain't having it. As soon as I step out there. My goodness. He's got several different ways he can blow the fire, doesn't he? Well, I don't know if this will work. Boom! Uh. Oh. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. That's hot. Run. Oh, he lights up the whole place. I should probably put on that fire resistant thing. He's just going to keep doing that. Oh my goodness! Oh, oh, he completely killed me! Well, that's kind of lame that he just sits there and keeps blowing fire like that. I thought I was actually going to get a chance to, like, duke it out with him. Hmm. Well, cheesing him with a uh, bow and arrow starting to sound a whole lot more... A whole lot more enticing. I expected him to blow some fire once in a while, but to just sit there and keep doing that? Is he up there? There he is. Yeah. I think I had around 10,000 souls. Let's see if I can go get him back. Boom! <laughs> That was great. Okay, they should be... Yeah, right there. To come back yet? Have I gone out far enough? Boink. I hit so hard. I love it. Yo, dragon. Ooh. Aw. Oh, I guess I can at least feed it to me. My friend. My goodness, look how distracted I am already. I have not made hardly any progress towards where I said I was going to, have I? Where'd you go? How do I get you back out here? Fly over? Are you? Oh, we got scared. 
He felt what it was like when I poked him that one time, and he's he's scared now. That's what I'm going with. Okay, since he don't want to play, we'll move on. I'll come back for him sooner or later. Ooh. Nice try. Uh, what is the ring I have on at the moment? Oh, I probably don't need that on right now. Let's go with the one for soul, since I'm just kind of running around with these guys here for a bit. Get the little bit of extra I can. Yep, instead of 96, I got 45. 115. I like it. Ooh, just dodged him. Gotcha. Woo. We'll go this way. Aha, got you first. 230. Boom! I feel so mean at the moment. Oh, he had a goodie. Nice. Oh, wait, there's a painting. Oh, no, it's a statue. Okay. Were there any paintings up in there? I don't recall seeing paintings here. Nice try. Gotcha. <laughs> I feel like a bully now. I used to come through here, and I felt like these guys picked on me all the time. But now I run through here, and I feel like the bully. And I'm kind of okay with that. My stamina bar is nice and long now. My goodness. Okay, let's go ahead and repair our goodies there we are uh i want to see i don't know if i have enough to take my bow up another another notch or not i know you can't use those ones that's okay though you've done a lot for me i won't hold it against you reinforced weapon no i need another chunk I need some more chunks. I'll be seeing you then. Yep. Okay, I'm going to swoosh us to the fire that is on that little ledge. All right, here we are. Am I hollow at the moment or human? You know what? I am not human. I figure I got all this humanity. Why not go ahead and restore that humanity? Oh yeah, much better. Okay, well, 13,000 is definitely not going to be enough to try to do anything of use for what I'm looking for. So let's continue on down. Oh, I'm so excited. I hope this works. I hope what I'm assuming is going to happen is kind of like that eye thing that I had when I walked into that one room. Remember how a message popped up on the screen saying that it was reacting? I'm hoping this is going to do that same sort of thing. Also, with the doll and the painting that I'll be looking for, I'm assuming that does kind of the same thing as well. So, fingers crossed. And yeah, I didn't realize there were two DLCs. I kept thinking there was one. But apparently... Huh. Yeah, I know I don't have to fight these guys, but they're easy. They might give me some loot, and... Uh, I'll use the souls for something eventually. Boom. <laughs> I remember when they weren't so easy. Oh, got him in the air. I was hoping that was gonna work. So, uh, I have had some people estimate, you know, I'm right around the 50 mark. I'm getting close to the 50 mark on my playthrough. And I've had some people say they think that I will end probably around if I do both DLCs, they're estimating probably 70, 75 episodes. I'm like, sweet! We just still got loads of this game to enjoy. All right, I'm putting this back on. This did make a difference in the water. <laughs> so awesome. Okay. Run over here. All right, come on, you little pendant. 
jiggle or vibe. Open a passageway, do something for me here. Oh, <gasps> I see something. That wasn't there before. Oh, I hope this works. Examine. It looks like a wormhole or something. Oh, what? What is that? Is that my mode of transportation? Because my goodness, that was brutal. Sanctuary Garden. What? I think it worked, though. I think I'm inside the DLC! Or at least one of them. Okay, first thing we're doing... I don't know, maybe I don't need to do this, but it's the very first thing in front of me. My guess is I'm gonna die at some point. Whoops. And this is where I'll be coming back to, so I might as well... Kindle it all the way up. In fact, someone told me you can go up to 20. I remember wondering that. Let's try it. I sure could. My goodness, 20 flasks? Are you kidding me? But man, that's going to eat through my humanity fast, isn't it? I feel like these things are a lot more rare than they used to be. All right, I'm going to at least put one on. Because if there's some drops I can get over here, I want to be able to try to get some. Wow. Well, I... Hold on. Let's take check the warp. So is the warp an option to come back here now? Oh, I see blood. How'd you die? You're like right here at the entrance. How did you die standing right there? I don't know. Imminent wings. Okay, not exactly sure what that means. So am I in Ulysseal? I think that's how that lady was pronouncing it. And she was talking about how she's from Ulysseal or her place is under attack or, or was under attack or something to that effect. Is this Ulysseal? Does it go straight to a fight? Need hope. Be weary of poison. Oh, I appreciate that heads up. Let's, uh... Now, if it's just poison, the purple moss would be enough. Okay, we'll try that. Okay, making sure I remember how, how to switch between them. Oh, here we go, baby. Let's see what's over you hear that? There's some kind of a creature. I hear something. Sanctuary Guardian. Oh my goodness. What are you? You are crazy looking. Oh. Oh, that was close. Oh. Oh boy. It's like I'm not even attacking yet. I'm just. Oh, oh I missed. And... Oh, too slow. Oh, he caught me with that one. Oh. My goodness, you're fast. I haven't even touched the guy yet. Oh, I was ready for the second swing. Oh, but I wasn't ready for the charge. Oh, crap. Oh, I tried to use two. I bet I can cut that tail off. Oh, I'm poisoned. Quick. Oh, did I use it in time? I think I did. My goodness, this guy's got so many moves. Okay. I'm figuring them out, though. I'm slowly learning these moves. What is this? Yo, <laughs> that was crazy. 
I'm making you work for it. Oh, it stayed on the ground. Finally got a hit. Yo, look how much damage I did. Oh, I took almost half his health with two hits. You better hope I don't get a hold of you, buddy. It's over. Chop off that tail. Come on. Oh. Oh, he's mad. Uh. Uh. Sit down. Yeah. <laughs> First try. Oh. And I got a humanity. Dang, that guy was a crazy enemy. Wow. I did good about staying patient, though. I was really trying to stay patient, figure out all his moves before I started trying to try and do any attacking. Oh, and I just realized I, I still had this on. I'm curious, did that make a difference? My. Oh, no, nope. I guess it's shallow enough. That didn't really make a difference here. I should probably go ahead and change this, though, to something. Uh, let's go. Hmm. I'm not quite sure. I've got so many good options. I don't know what types of enemies I'm going to be fighting here. But you can never go wrong with too much poise, right? Let's go poise. Okay, now, the guardian soul that I found. Can I make a weapon out of that? Soul of the white-winged lion sanctuary watchkeeper who dreaded the spread of the abyss. Who dreaded... The spread of the abyss. The guardian exhibited traits of several animals other than lions, suggesting that it was no ordinary beast, but rather closer to the beings known as demons. That thing was crazy. I really was hoping I could maybe chop his tail off. That was amazing, though. Now, it's not saying here... Soul of Sang so like this one it says or create a unique weapon. This doesn't say that, so I wonder if this is something I should just use. I'm gonna hang on to it for now. Maybe it can be used as a a key or something here at some point. But wow, when I saw how much damage my first hit did, I was like, oh, he's totally dead. But I was like, I'm gonna figure this guy's moves out before I start trying to make swings and open myself up to some pretty big hits. Well, we're right here, and this will put me back at 20 flasks, so let's go ahead and hit this. Oh, and I actually might be able to get a level. Yep. Uh, let's go Vitality. Or should I go Endurance? We'll go Vitality. It feels weird my Vitality number being smaller than my Endurance number. Oh, and let's go ahead and repair my stuff since I'm right here, too. Uh, this one. I know it's not much damage, and it may not even be that necessary, but... It's one of those things that if I don't do it regularly, I'm, like, totally gonna forget. And then something's gonna break. And then I will feel it. <sighs> I'm so glad I made that. Now, is that the same castle that we're used to seeing? Is that a whole different castle back there in the background? Oh boy, what am I in store for? This place sounds amazing though. I love that. Okay. Starting off strong. Confidence is nice and high, but hopefully not cocky. Ula Seal Sanctuary. There's another bonfire. I don't know if I want to... Uh, I guess I'll, I'll light it. I'm not going to kindle this one up, though. The other one's not too far away, so... Uh, we'll see where it goes from here. Did these used to be people? Part of me wanted to go around and start breaking them, see if anything was on the inside, but... I almost feel like if these are... Gravestones or something. That would I'd be I'd feel very mean. Can I talk to you? Well, look at this one. From what far away age hast thou come? Thy scent is very human indeed, but not intolerable. Ah, 
Ah, Princess Dusk's saviour. Thine aura is precisely as she described. Oh. I thank thee deeply for rescuing her highness. But Princess Dusk is here no longer. Snatched away by that horrifying primeval human. And so I must ask, couldst thou once more play the saviour? Yes. Thank you. I am Elizabeth, guardian of this sanctuary. Something of a godmother to Princess Dusk. Mm. I shall assist thee to my utmost, for I am one with the sorceries of Ulysseel. That is so cool. What do we got here? Repairs weapons equipped in right hand. Oh, that's kind of cool. So I don't, I don't even have to, like, go somewhere to do that. Applies lightning. You know, I haven't used those attributes very often. It didn't seem like it lasted very long, you know? Yo, check this out. Hidden weapon, hidden body. Ancient sorcery of the lost land of Ulysseel turns body nearly invisible. Although perfect invisibility is unachievable due to the risk of dissipation, the caster need only stand still for a moment to blend in with the environs with astounding camouflage. That would actually be pretty cool. Hidden weapon. Wow. Ah, gosh. There's so much stuff in this game that I have not really gotten to experience because it's like like all the magic stuff. But then when there's magic stuff, you got different forms of magic you could try to dabble in. There's different weapon types you can get. You know, are you going to be a strength or a dexterity? It, it's crazy to think of all the options. I can see why people played through it so many times. You could play this thing a dozen times and every one of them, it could be completely different. You know what I mean? That's crazy. Ulysseel Ivory Catalyst. Sorcery Catalyst of Lost Land of Ulysseel, formed by enchanted white bark branches. The white bark boosts sorcery adjustment, but the sorceries of this lost land are gentle and not affected by intelligence. Wow. Okay, what else you got? You shall see further on. An abyss was begat of the ancient beast and threatens to swallow the whole of Ulysseel. Knight Artorius came to stop this. But such a hero has nary a murmur of dark. Without doubt, he will be swallowed by the abyss, overcome by its utter blackness. Oh. Indeed, the abyss may be unstoppable. Still, I have faith that Princess Dusk may be rescued yet. Oh! Thou shalt see further on. An abyss was begat okay. at the ancient so beast. She just says the same thing. Threatens to so, is this a different abyss than what we fought those knights in? Or is it, like, spreading? I'm glad I didn't go around trying to destroy all this stuff and then go up to her and she's like, I'm the guardian of this. <laughs> Oops! Hope you didn't see me do that. Oop. Oh, there's something back there. I was like, man, I can't believe there's, like, nothing back here. Oh, yeah, found a humanity. Okay, well, since there was one on this side, I know I did check this side, but I want to make sure I check it one more time. Okay. Hope you're not related to the two mushrooms I slaughtered back in my area. Okay, well, what are we in store for here? Oh, those look interesting. Are they frogs standing on their hind legs? Wow, it's beautiful. Wow. I can't believe I made it into the DLC, y'all. Oh, I'm so excited for this. Okay. Let's, let's test it. Oh, he ain't gonna wait. Oh, I assume... Oh, he is coming around. It's got like a three-prong pitchfork kind of thing. Whoop! Are you guys made of, like, 
sticks and moss? Look, they really are. These are literally made of sticks. <laughs> That's crazy. The Royal Woods. Or Royal Wood. Okay, I'm going to go up the way they came down. I'm wondering if this is another one of those situations where they can, like, hide in the ground and come busting up at me. Okay, I see some over there. This place is beautiful. I love the colors that we see popping up here. I feel like a lot of the Dark Souls area that I've run into so far, they're very... Uh, gr a lot of grays, obviously. That's why I know Orlando really stands out because it looks so bright and clean. But seeing the oranges and in the sky up here and some of the reds in the plants, this is nice. It's got some, it's got a little pop of color that I haven't been finding anywhere else. Okay, I see something big over here. Looks different. Uh, oh boy. Okay, let's take you out first. Oh my goodness! He pulled the whole ground up with him. Uh, missed me. Oh, he dove at me. <laughs> I thought I had more time. I did not. So this is like a... Oh, this is a stone guy. But he's wearing some different garments. Okay. I'm fine with that. Dressed up in some different outfits. All right. I am trying to pay attention in case there's any of those little, like, two-headed snake things, lizard things hanging from the trees. We've run across, like, this right here. I feel like I should be able to pick that up. Collect some herbs. Ooh, we got something over here. Ooh. Oh, well, there's no bridge to it on this side. Maybe down there. That sounds amazing, the, the creature sounds we're hearing. Okay, well, before we cross through there... Any treasure around this corner? I know they've done that sometimes. That thing's wild looking. I see a lot of blood in there. That makes me a little nervous. Nope. This guy first. Uh. Oh, crap. <laughs> I wasn't ready. Oh. I should have been ready for that. I think I hear somebody coming. To the side. Uh. There we go. Well, I definitely got to see what it's like to fly through the air. I thought I saw something glowing on you. Oh, there's a bunch of them on this spot. Okay, let's check this way a little bit first. I'm kind of, I'm trying to weave my way through here, so hopefully I don't miss anything. They're like surrounding that lake. Are they like guarding something valuable? It almost looks. Huh. I choose you. Oop. You guys refuse to come by yourself, don't you? Whoop. I missed. Whoop. Get you both. Nope. Oh, he got me. Get out of the way. Out of the way. Oh, man, that was close. Huh, my turn. Oh no. Dang it. I thought I could finish him first. Oh. I'm so glad I've got 20 flasks. I feel like I'm still running on my freebies. <laughs> oh, this is great. Okay. 
Yeah, I remember with the mushrooms, there was a little treasure chest in the middle of what was being guarded. So I, part of me wondered if maybe they were doing that as well. Gotcha. Uh. Okay. Take you up first. Oop. Ooh. That stone guy's... He's pretty quick. Uh. Yeah, you gonna pull up the ground? No? Gotcha. <laughs> Man, I've come so, so far from where I used to be. Twinkling twilight. I feel like I've improved so much. Okay. A lot of blood in here. What's that? Did you try to take them all on at once? Yeah, that's what it's looking like. Might have just got overrun. Okay, I know I saw... Oh, we got flowers over here. Let's see... Nothing up here I missed, right? Oh, we got some people across there. My goodness, the area is so big. Oh, hello. We're both poking the tree. Come here, please. Oh! Oh! I goofed that one up. My, oh my. So many places to go. Can I, I can't, I can't climb up that. Maybe I go around. Oh, they got a watering pot. I don't want to kill you. Are you guys, well, I was going to say, or ask if you guys are friendly, but obviously that's not the case. <laughs> well, I didn't see you till it was too late. Gotcha. I feel like I slaughtered like a family or something here. I feel so wrong. They were just tending to their garden, that's all. Stone protector. <laughs> You're kind of a little ways away. Have they all been having that little water pot on them and I just didn't even notice? Look at the size of that hammer. Oh, no. Oh! I keep forgetting he can do that while the hammer's down. Well played, well played. What do we got here? Guardian leggings. Let's scope him out, shall we? Mm, here we go. Yeah, everything goes up. 800 durability. Leggings of the Stone Knights, Guardians of the Forest Sanctuary. The Stone Knights are golems animated by magic, and their enchanted legs are oppressively heavy. Oppressively. <laughs> okay, I did read that right. At first, I thought they were trying to say impressively. That's not the case. Okay. Trying to be thorough here. Check down all the different paths. Is there a way? Okay, I don't see a way to get up on that ledge up there. And okay, there's a way to hop down there. Okay, I can walk down that way. I saw a little path. Okay, this leads me back up onto the shelf I was already on. Nice thing about doing so much without hitting the bonfire is all these enemies that I take out, they stay gone. And it's like, I don't have to worry about accidentally tracking through an area I'd actually already been through once before. Ooh, that's a ways down there, isn't it? Okay, so we got the bridge over there to that side. Okay, let's finish checking this before I venture that way. Okay, was there a bridge inside of this building right here? It didn't look like it connected from the other side. Oh. That trigger an elevator. 
That looks like a long ways down, doesn't it? Ooh. Guardian gauntlets. Can I walk off and smack that? No, okay. I don't know, maybe I had to drop on that from a height to trigger it. Okay, maybe that's something we come back up through. What is that orange thing over there? I don't know, let's see if we can go get a closer look. Looks like now we will cross on the bridge. Because I think, you guys can let me know if I missed anything, but I think I combed through the area over here really well. I don't think I missed anything. I've been trying not to have that. Oh, hello. Are you the beast? Dude, that thing looked amazing. It had like, it was all black with these red eyes that looked right at me. Imminent dragon. Well, yeah, I would agree. There was definitely an imminent dragon right there. Here's something marching around up there. I don't want to be on this tiny little ledge fighting, though. Let's see if I can get to a safer area. Oh, hello. Uh, oh, hello. Oh. Well, I managed to get it, and I didn't die. I'm, I'm happy with that. How do I get back up? What is this? The roaring sound. Sounds like thunder. I think it is thunder. Oh, jump. Okay. My goodness. We got another beautiful waterfall out here. A few of them, actually. That's crazy. Look how far down. Oh my gosh, there's a blue thing. I can get down. There's a bunch of blue things. I can get down all the way to there? No way. No way. <laughs> That's amazing. Okay. All right, Ben, remember, they can pull the ground up from under you. Or just straight up smack you, too. That That's a good possibility. Oh, I missed... Oh, we both went for it at the same time. You chump. Finally. Okay. Come on now. These trees are being unnoose. Oh, what? No. These cramped quarters. <laughs> okay. This dre... This Ridiculous! That was so ridiculous. The trees were in the way. I couldn't hit him. Apparently, he could smash me with every move I made. That was terrible. <laughs> I was just bragging about how everything that was there is not there any longer. But now it's all back. <laughs> My goodness. Uh, I don't think the poise ring is actually doing me really any like good no advantages or anything i was thinking maybe boost my critical hits but most of the stuff i'm hitting i kill with one attack so i think i'm gonna go with um do i want to go with steel protection which would work good against all the physical stuff or should i put on the souls thing we'll go with this i like that Oh, and I guess I... You know what? I'm going to go ahead and leave the poison thing on there. Who knows? Maybe it'll be important against one of the enemy types I encounter. Okay. Stone guy got so lucky. And then even the little stick guy that was next to him, it's like, 
my timing of my swings and the timing of his swings were just staggered enough to where he could just keep keep hitting me. I used more flask and lost more health in that one little encounter right there than I did everything getting to that point. Okay, I do see the path here. We're, we're going to see if we can kind of beeline our way back over there a little bit. That way you guys don't have to watch me refight all of these guys. I just hope this doesn't come back to bite me because I'm like not fighting them. You know what I mean? Because there are quite a few creatures through here. I wonder, will they follow me across the bridge? If I get them all lined up on a bridge, I might be able to just sit there and keep swinging at them. Look at that. They're going for it. Some of them. You bringing it? Good. Pull the ground up on this bridge. Oh. Oh, there's two now. Oh, boy. Oh. I didn't want to be on this tiny little ledge. I can't even see. I couldn't see. I was trying to roll the whole time and I could not move. <sighs> there went all those souls. I had like 13, 14,000. All right, I'm going to swoosh us back at least to the entrance of the little garden area. Okay, we're going to try this again. I think the strategy was working okay. Okay, they're going to go off to the right. I just got trapped by those stone guys. I wasn't expecting the one from the top to come <laughs> falling down on me. But once I had two stone giants on me, man, I wasn't moving nowhere. In fact, if I could get the stone guy to fall down there and then I leave, that may not be a bad little strategy. Then I don't deal with them at all. Ugh. Gotcha. You know what? I was about to use arrows, but I right, should be falling down any second. There he is. Oh, the one's leaving. Oh, he's running. I didn't realize they could run. No wonder they're able to get to me so fast sometimes. Good to know. Oh, ooh. okay. I rolled that one just right. You're mine. See you, chump. Your backup ran off. <laughs> oh, you gotta love them ragdoll effects, man. It's like a little celebration or something. Man, I lost all that humanity and stuff I had. Oh, apparently falling off here is something I was supposed to do. Because, look, you can't even get up here. Unless there's a ladder or something, but I don't see one. Well, that makes me feel a little better, too, about the little dive attack I made at that little guy. There's a jump over here, though. I feel like I got lucky making a minute ago. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh! Dude! How am I not hitting you? This place sounds amazing. It sounds really awesome. Okay, yeah, there's like a little gap right here. Huh. Okay. I want to get my loot. I'm going to bring the stone guy out here this time so he doesn't have all those trees he can use on me as easily. I don't know, would fire work very well on a stone guy? He's walking off a little ways, isn't he? Oh, look at that. I managed to hit him. He is like totally not going for it, is he? He's going all the way over to guard that thing? You chump. Okay. 
I see how you are. I'll take care of your little friends first. Mm-hmm. Boom, baby. You like them skills, right? Aiming at you where you were going? You ain't got no shield. Oh, he's running. Yeah, come out here. Come out here. Oh, you're gonna regret it. Oh! Yep. I ain't falling for it. Oh, that tree stopped me from jumping back. I got lucky. I was ready for the pull up. But that tree was in my way again. Who would have thought just these trees being here would make such a big obstacle? Yeah, right over here. Oh. Got some great arrows. I can't look at all the loot down there. My goodness. I think I've counted at least five blue orbs just laying down there, beckoning me to make the jump. I ain't gonna do it. Guardian armor. I've almost got the whole set now, don't I? Wow, this place is enormous. I love thunder. I love thunderstorms. I think I've said this in other playthroughs, but some nights if I'm struggling to sleep, I'll just turn on a video where it's nothing but the sound of thunderstorms and I'll just listen to that. I love it. And this thunder, man, it sounds impressive. Ooh, there's a little gap right there. I'm glad I I'm glad I looked. Jump. There's the helmet. I got the full set now. Can I just walk off here? Sure looks like it. Yo! I don't want to slip and fall down the giant creepy hole. Oh, hello. You garden anything delicious back here? Some goodies maybe? Aha! Uh -huh. Elizabeth Mushroom? That's new. What's that gonna be for? Greatly restores HP for a limited duration. Elizabeth Mushroom. Large medicinal mushroom of Elizabeth. Keeper of the sanctuary. Oh yeah, yeah. That was the lady we met at the entrance. Eating this mushroom invigorates the flesh and greatly restores HP for a limited time. Limited duration. So does it mean like it will keep refilling me for a little bit, like I take damage and it gives me health back. Its dramatic effect can make the difference between a warrior's life and death. I like the sound of that. If that's how it works, that's nice to know. There's a little piece of Elizabeth grown out here. Oh, that's a ravine. <laughs> I thought there was a dead body over there for a minute. Okay, let's go up onto this ledge, I think. I think I'm ready to drop off. Here. Oh! What was that? Why did that do that? Oh, that scared the crap out of me. I thought something, I thought I was falling through the floor. I don't know if I landed on something or what, but that's very unexpected. Hello! I see you down there. Apparently you see me. Don't mind me. Just trying to see if there's loot over here to be had. Okay. Looks like nothing in this immediate spot. Are they coming around? I see this black smoke coming up out of the corner of my eye. I thought something was rising up. Where are you 
guys going? Oh, do you even know? Gotcha. I hope these aren't like all the servants and stuff from that princess. And I'm just going around slaughtering them all. Yeah, princess, glad I saved you, but I uh, got some bad news. You know all those servants you used to have following you around? Although I, I might be able to just be like, hold on a second, let me rest at a bonfire. I'll bring them all back. All right, I see a blue thing all the way over there. How are we doing? Okay, we're getting close to the hour. Not quite there just yet. I'm keep going. Man, I hope I'm not missing sections. I'm trying to be thorough, but a lot of the area looks very much the same. Oh, there's a... Let's see if I can get a hit on it. Oink! Stay put! Stay put! Come here! Oh, I got another hit on it. Oh, one more hit. I would have had it. I was worried it was too far away. If I ran up on it, it would just run off. Is this what I broke earlier? Oh, I must have landed on something like that. Okay. Well, that makes me feel a little better. It wasn't the floor I was about to break out on me. i got quite a few over here. Let me get a backstab maybe on one of these giants. That would definitely help lighten the... If I can get up over this little bump. Oh! 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 Ho -ho! Boy! Wow! That did not work out near as well as I had hoped. Oh! My goodness, you two get out of the way. Ooh. So much my little backstab idea of maybe saving me some effort. I gotta get better at diving in the direction that's against their weapon. I've got a bad habit of like always diving to the left. And I get knocked in the air and stuff all the time because of it. Okay. I'll admit it could have gone better, but I survived. Is that safe to walk on? Oh, hello. Well, I haven't finished. Okay, we got a little bit more, I think, up here to explore. Then we'll see about going down there. This place is enormous. It's like I got a whole other city to go explore. What are you doing? They're trimming the trees. Oh, I really don't want to hurt these people. They're just trying to live life, man. Let's see if I don't attack them. Maybe they won't attack me. Found a gold coin. Nope, they uh, they want to fight. They're like, get out of our garden. Out of our forest. Don't worry, I'm just trying to take all your stuff. <laughs> That's all. Oh, there's a bunch of these guys now. I'm in trouble. Oh. Gotcha. There you are. I did try to let you live, just so you know, you guys. This isn't entirely on me. Okay. I thought there was something up here. Oh, yes. I wonder what these little things are. Is that part of the abyss that she was talking about? Like, coming up through the land? Oh, was there a path that led around? No, this is... I could drop down. I don't want to do that. That'll be backtracking. 
Okay, I know where I'm at, and I think... I think I've cleared through all of this space up here. Oh, I guess I could have come around that way, huh? Oh. Eat this, Abyss. I don't know if that's what it represents. But until I hear otherwise... Alright, I'm going to try to let you two live over there. Did you come over here trying to start something? I will finish it. Sounds like they're just working. Good. You just work with your little friends. Anything? Okay, I don't see anything on the sides. My goodness, that does go a long ways down. All right, well, you guys can definitely let me know if I missed anything critical up here, but I think I cleared through all of that pretty thoroughly. There's a lot of zigzagging back and forth, but I think I pulled it off. Is that a, is that a bonfire over there? Just like an NPC? Hello. Ooh, that leads down. My goodness, I got so many directions I could go. We got the, the fog door there. How far does it go this way? Maybe it doesn't go far this way. Check it for loot. Just don't slide off. Oh, man. Yeah, we, we've got two big directions we can go, it looks like. Maybe three, depending on what's on the other side of this bridge. See what these messages say. Imminent charmer. Bravery. Bravery. Okay. I don't know. Maybe bravery is supposed to be a hint of something, but... I don't know what bravery is supposed to mean. Okay. Nothing else in that area. What is this? It is somebody standing over here. Dude, you look kind of like a mime or something. Hmm. Ah, let me guess. Snatched by a shadowy limb and mm -hmm. dragged off to the past. The past? Yes, of course. Exactly what happened to me. We are both strangers in this strange land. But at least now there are two of us. I like his voice. That's nice. What you selling? What you selling? Most of the stuff I got already. Oh, he sells straight up humanity for 10000 a pop. Oh, boy, he sells arrows at 20 Was I paying... Was I paying 10 over there? I don't remember. Yeah, I think I was paying 10 and I think these were 65 Good thing I'm stocked up on arrows. Did you happen across Knight Artorias? The legendary abyss walker from the old tales. Well, if you haven't, it's just as well. He's a colorless sort, if you ask me. <laughs> so, what did that giant mushroom make you do? Not that I care. It's none of my business. <laughs> I'm getting vibes from this guy like I can't trust him. Kind of like that, the gold guy ended up killing my fire... Fire lady. Hmm. I've little to talk about, really. Oh, you know me. What do I know? <laughs> so long. All right. Oh, well, this... Is this the one that I was standing on and it didn't do anything? It's going to take me back up. Ah, ha, ha. Okay, I've started learning the lay of the land here. So now I have to decide. Do I go through the white fog door first? Or do we go down the path? I was thinking the path because I don't have a bonfire anywhere near here. And I figure if I go down this way, I got better odds maybe finding one, right? Okay, well, we are definitely past the hour, but we're going to go a little bit further. Hopefully, I don't find that big black dragon down here. And it kills me. 
And then I regret this move. Mm. Okay, let's go this way first. Oh, swing and a miss. Not gonna miss like that. Over here. Enemy ahead. Okay. I don't see an enemy. Oh, I see it now. It's like a wolf or something. There's a couple of them. Let's see what happens. Oh, boy. Oh. Oh, I missed. Oh, there's another one. Down, boy. I missed again. I'm locked onto the guy. How do I miss? All right. Down, boys. I kept trying to do this move because I figured I'd hit all three of them at one time, but no. Some weird looking dogs. All right. My guess is that's not the last of them I'll see. I'll take that. Try to see if there's any doors or hallways or anything. You guys know sometimes I get to running and totally miss stuff off to the side. <laughs> Kicking the dog. Yeah. It's like they got some kind of logging service or something going on down here. Why is there a hole right there? End right there. Not going to be something come out and grab me, is there? Okay, I see you, doggy. Oh, what? 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 Totally swung first. Oh. Oh, that time I swung early thinking I needed to do it early. And I hit the ground. Not cool. Here. Imminent tears. Good luck. Tail. Is there like a fight on the other side of this? Okay, well, that is going to be where we end it for, for this episode. My goodness, I'm so pumped. I finally made it into. I'm assuming this is the DLC. I feel like I was taken off into a whole nother area. So this, I'm assuming, is the DLC. Unless I hear from you guys that this is not the DLC, it's just another area I could get to in the main game. But this feels like a whole DLC kind of thing to me. And that was so cool. That hand that went out and grabbed me, it looked kind of like it had little suction cup type things on it. I thought it was like an octopus or a fish type thing. But part of me wonders if it's maybe that dragon that we saw. He reached out, grabbed me, and pulled me through. I don't know. But that guardian that we fought, as soon as we arrived on the other side, super cool looking enemy. Lots of different moves. Nice big area. That was a fun fight. I enjoyed that, and I'm glad I got a victory on the first try. Okay, well, until next time, continue to be safe out there, buddy. I'll see you on the next one.